It's six in the morning and I think I am the only person in this whole train. <laughs> That flight was a lot better. No emergency landing. We had good food. I got into trouble because I was filming inside of the airport. Don't do that. I took a quick nap because I'm very exhausted. But now I'm heading outside and I think I will meet Jacko in probably two hours and hopefully my brother in one hour. I met my brother <laughs> and his friend. <laughs> All right, I had to take it outside because it was super loud in that bar, but I just met my brother in New York. We don't get to see each other as much as we like to, which makes occasions like these extra special. Oh, and by the way, that is an excellent bar. So eight years ago, when my brother and I met in New York, we went to this bar to have a Long, to have a Long Island iced tea, and... <laughs> <laughs> it was pretty epic because we totally underestimated the drink. I think um, the Long Island iced tea is made to be underestimated. So now we're meeting again in New York and we thought we should go to that bar and grab another Long Island iced tea. <laughs> the drink wasn't as good as our memories so we ended up in a different bar. But we still had a great evening in the city. Circle now to meet a couple of guys for a coffee. Hopefully, we stop doing that. <laughs> Thanks for everybody who came out to say hi. It is so cool to be traveling and meeting people in another country. Afterwards, Becky Stern took me on a tour with her awesome motorcycle. Perfect. motorcycle ride through New York man thank you so much for taking me Becky also you guys check out Becky's channel and she has awesome instructables too I am very starstruck right now but we are in Tom Sykes studio and he's showing us around taking a lot of time to show us all the details of it we just started the tour so I will I want to try and film a little of it Cool. I'm, I'm happy you're cool with us filming here. Yeah, absolutely. <gasps> no. no. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I know, those are the old ones. Uh, and now, yeah, they're supposed to come out like any day. These were the, so these were the beautiful. Ones, I know, it's yeah. super frustrating. I'm sorry everyone who's watching. I can't, it's not within my control. You have to learn to um, work <laughs> on the, control the things that you can control and let go of the others. <laughs> Um, that's like the key to survival. So this is just like our supply. This is a part of our tarpaulin. This is our New York City tarpaulin stash. We have a bigger tarpaulin stash now in Philadelphia. This is like, this is like a political thing. I traveled to New York in the first place was that Jimmy invited me to help build a teepee on his property. We were a group of roughly 20 people I would say um, and the best part about this get together was that we had a couple of days to really hang out and really get to know each other.
If you want to see the TP come together, check out Jimmy's blog. And in my video description, there's a list of other creators who did a much better job documenting the weekend than I did. Also, there was enough time and opportunity to work on other projects besides the TP. We spent some time in Jimmy's shop and I got to use his awesome lathe and also picked up some tricks from him. Jacko Whatever and I had a fantastic time hanging out together and I think you can expect some collaboration soon. Thank you everybody, especially Jimmy and Jacko who helped me with my champagne sprinkler video. <laughs> I don't think I ever had that much fun filming the end of a video. Who's got the close-up? Oh, yeah. Who's got the close-up? Like, close the fuck up. I'm not from behind. I'm from behind. Yeah, go back and <laughs> And that concludes my trip to New York. Again, Jimmy, thank you so much for having us. We had the best time.